Hello everyone. In today's video, we are going to talk about camshaft and crankshaft. Sometimes people mistake a camshaft for a crankshaft, so we are going to talk about the difference between camshaft and crankshaft, the major functions of a camshaft and crankshaft in the car engine, symptoms of a bad camshaft and crankshaft in a car. But before we continue, please hit the subscription button and turn on the notification bell so that you will be the first to see my video once it drops. Thank you. What is the difference between a camshaft and a crankshaft? The camshaft and crankshaft are both essential components in an internal combustion engine, but they serve distinct purposes and operate in different ways. Here are the key differences between the camshaft and crankshaft. 1. Function. Camshaft. The camshaft is responsible for controlling the opening and closing of the engine's intake and exhaust valves. It determines the timing and duration of valve events, coordinating with the piston movements for efficient combustion. Crankshaft. The crankshaft converts the reciprocating motion of the pistons into rotational motion, providing the main power output of the engine. It translates the up and down motion of the pistons into a rotary motion that drives the vehicle's transmission and ultimately the wheels. 2. Location. Camshaft, typically located in the cylinder head of the engine. The camshaft is positioned above the cylinders and is parallel to the crankshaft. Crankshaft. Located in the engine block, the crankshaft runs longitudinally along the bottom of the engine. It is connected to the pistons through connecting rods. 3. Shape. Camshaft. The camshaft has lobes or cams along its length. These lobes are specifically shaped to open and close the valves at precise intervals, coordinating with the engine cycle. Crankshaft. The crankshaft is a long cylindrical shaft with offset crank pins. The offset crank pins convert the linear motion of the pistons into rotational motion. 4. Movement. Camshaft. The camshaft rotates at half the speed of the crankshaft. It is driven by a timing belt or chain, ensuring synchronization with the engine's cycle. Crankshaft. The crankshaft rotates at the speed of the engine, and it is driven by the pistons through the connecting rods. The rotational motion of the crankshaft is what ultimately powers the vehicle. 5. Timing Relationship – Camshaft The timing relationship between the camshaft and crankshaft is crucial for proper valve operation. This relationship is often referred to as camshaft timing. Crankshaft – The crankshaft timing, or ignition timing, determines when the spark plug ignites the air-fuel mixture in the combustion chamber. 6. Number – Camshaft An engine can have multiple camshafts, depending on its design. For example, a dual overhead cam, DOHC engine has two camshafts, one for the intake valves and one for the exhaust valves. Crankshaft. There is typically only one crankshaft in an engine. In summary, while both the camshaft and crankshaft play integral roles in the engine's operation, the camshaft is primarily responsible for valve timing, and the crankshaft converts reciprocating motion into rotational motion to drive the vehicle. Their collaborative function is essential for the efficient operation of an internal combustion engine. What are the major functions of the camshaft in the car engine? The camshaft in a car engine performs several crucial functions related to the timing and operation of the engine's valves. Here are the major functions of the camshaft. Valve timing. The primary function of the camshaft is to control the timing of the engine's intake and exhaust valves. It determines when these valves open and close, in relation to the position of the piston and the overall engine cycle. Valve lift. The camshaft's lobes are designed to lift the engine's valves during their opening phase. The shape of these lobes influences the amount of lift, determining how far the valve is open. Valve duration. Camshaft lobe is also dictate the duration for which the valves remain open. This duration is crucial for optimizing the engine's performance, efficiency, and emissions. Intake valve opening. The camshaft opens the intake valves at the appropriate time during the engine cycle to allow the air-fuel mixture to enter the combustion chamber. Exhaust valve opening. The camshaft opens the exhaust valves at the right moment to allow the evacuation of burnt gases from the combustion chamber. Overlap. Overlap is the brief period during the engine cycle when both the intake and exhaust valves are slightly open. The camshaft controls this overlap to optimize combustion efficiency and performance. Engine performance. By precisely controlling valve timing, lift, and duration, the camshaft significantly influences overall engine performance, 
including power output, torque, and fuel efficiency. Variable valve timing, VVT. In some modern engines, the camshaft incorporates variable valve timing technology. VVT allows for dynamic adjustment of the camshaft position, optimizing valve timing based on driving conditions. This improves performance and fuel efficiency. Idle stability. The camshaft contributes to stable idling by controlling the valve timing during the engine's idle state. Proper idle characteristics are essential for smooth engine operation. Engine efficiency. The camshaft plays a critical role in maximizing engine efficiency by ensuring that the intake and exhaust processes are synchronized with the piston movements and overall engine cycle. Overall engine operation. The camshaft's functions are intricately tied to the overall operation of the engine. Properly timed valve events lead to efficient combustion, reduced emissions, and optimal engine behavior. In summary, the camshaft is a key component that orchestrates the precise timing and movement of the engine's valves. Its functions have a direct impact on the engine's performance, efficiency, and emissions making it a critical element in the overall operation of a car engine. What are the major functions of the crankshaft in a car? The crankshaft in a car performs several critical functions that are essential for the proper functioning of the engine. Here are the five major functions of the crankshaft are converts, reciprocating motion to rotational motion. The primary function of the crankshaft is to convert the reciprocating motion of the pistons into rotational motion. As the pistons move up and down in the cylinders, the offset crank pins on the crankshaft translate this motion into a circular motion, providing the rotational force needed to drive the vehicle. Provides rotational power to the drivetrain. The crankshaft is connected to the transmission, and ultimately, the wheels of the vehicle. By converting reciprocating motion to rotational motion, the crankshaft transfers power to the drivetrain, propelling the vehicle forward or backward, balances and reduces vibrations. Counterweights are strategically placed on the crankshaft to counteract the reciprocating forces generated by the movement of the pistons. This balancing function helps reduce vibrations and ensures smooth engine operation. Balancing is crucial for the overall comfort and longevity of the engine. Drives external components. The front end of the crankshaft typically features a pulley or harmonic balancer which is connected to external components such as the alternator, power steering pump, and air conditioning compressor. The rotation of the crankshaft powers these accessories, contributing to the vehicle's electrical and mechanical systems, timing synchronization with the camshaft. The crankshaft and camshaft are synchronized to ensure precise timing of valve opening and closing. The crankshaft has timing marks that work in conjunction with the camshaft to maintain proper valve timing, optimizing combustion efficiency and overall engine performance. Understanding these functions highlights the crucial role of the crankshaft in the overall operation of the internal combustion engine. It serves as the central component that transforms the linear motion of the pistons into the rotational motion needed to drive the vehicle. Regular maintenance, including proper lubrication and alignment, is essential to ensure the longevity and optimal performance of the crankshaft. Symptoms of a bad camshaft and crankshaft in a car. Symptoms of a bad camshaft and crankshaft in a car can vary, and diagnosing engine issues should be done by a professional mechanic. However, certain symptoms may indicate problems with these components. Here are common signs associated with a bad camshaft and crankshaft. Symptoms of a bad camshaft. Check engine light. Illumination of the check engine light on the dashboard may indicate issues with the camshaft position sensor or other related components. Poor acceleration. Difficulty accelerating smoothly or a noticeable lack of power during acceleration. Rough idling. Engine idling may become irregular or rough, and the vehicle may experience vibrations when stationary. Misfires. Misfires or stumbling in the engine, especially under load or during acceleration. Poor fuel efficiency. Decreased fuel efficiency, as the camshaft plays a role in optimizing fuel delivery and combustion. Engine stalling. The engine may stall unexpectedly, particularly when idling or coming to a stop. Poor emission levels, increased emissions due to inefficient combustion processes controlled by the camshaft. Strange noises. Unusual noises from the engine, such as ticking or tapping sounds, which may indicate worn cam lobes or other camshaft-related issues. 
Timing issues. Timing-related problems, including incorrect valve timing, leading to decreased engine performance. Symptoms of a bad crankshaft. Engine vibration, excessive engine vibration, especially at idle, which may be caused by imbalances or damage to the crankshaft. Engine knocking. Knocking or banging noises coming from the engine, suggesting issues with the crankshaft or connecting rod bearings. Difficulty starting. Difficulty starting the engine or prolonged cranking time before the engine starts. Oil leaks. Oil leaks around the rear, main seal or other areas of the engine, indicating potential crankshaft seal or bearing problems. Loss of power. Decreased engine power and performance, especially during acceleration. Increased engine oil consumption. Higher than normal oil consumption, potentially due to damaged crankshaft seals or excessive clearance in the bearings. Check engine light. The check engine light may illuminate, signaling issues with the crankshaft position sensor or other related components. Harmonic balancer. Issues. Visible damage or separation of the harmonic balancer, which is connected to the front end of the crankshaft. It's essential to address these symptoms promptly by consulting a professional mechanic. Ignoring issues with the camshaft or crankshaft can lead to more significant engine damage and potentially result in costly repairs. Regular maintenance and prompt diagnosis of engine-related symptoms contribute to the longevity and reliability of your vehicle. So, for you not to miss any of our videos on car maintenance, hit the subscription button and turn on the notification bell so that you will be the first to see our video once it drops. Thank you and have a wonderful day.